Okay, on this video for the TV Star T1010 DTT receiver, we're going to show you how to use the media player facilities on this box. Okay, so just to start off, um, this box will play, uh, will say various video types of formats, um, AVI, MKV, VOB, MP4, things like that. As regards pictures, it'll play JPEGs and bitmaps. And as regards music, it'll play MP3s and WMAs, okay? So, just before I show you exactly how to do this, obviously you want to have an external hard drive or USB memory stick or something like this plugged into the box. We always recommend using um, an external hard drive. Um, there's just there's a couple of reasons mainly. It's just the size of them, basically. You can, you can store a lot more on them. And B, um, the transfer rates on them are far better. So you get far better reliability as regards playback and things like that, okay? So just to access the menus for this, you hit the menu button, you arrow over as far as the USB menu, you arrow down as far as multimedia, and then it brings you in to this sub-menu here, okay? Now, just to be aware, um, I'm going to show you this, and I'm going to actually do this the, the wrong way around, just to illustrate to you what not to do, okay? So... Basically, I'm just going to show you the music working for now, okay? So I'm going to highlight music and I'm going to press OK. That brings me into my hard drive there and I'm just going to arrow down to this little folder I have here with different samples of different types of files, okay? So I press OK to go in there and I'm just going to go to my tunes folder, okay? So the first thing is I'm going to just play this MP3 sample here. I'll just turn up the volume there and let you hear it. Okay, so I'm just going to hit stop button there. Now it'll also play WMAs as well, so that's handy. Now, this is the bit I want to show you. I'm just going to hit the recall button to go up a folder now. Now, just say you thought, okay, well, I'm finished listening to my music. I'll just go in and listen to my film or look at my films. I'm going to go into my flicks and it shows absolutely nothing. Now, I know I've 20 or 30 little samples in that folder. And why is that? Well, the reason that's the case is that I previously selected that I only want that I wanted to look for music, not films. Okay, so just be aware of that. It doesn't mean there's something wrong with the box or something wrong with your hard drive. You've just selected the wrong thing. If you find this happens to you, okay. So I'm just going to hit the recall button here now, and I'm going to go back out. So lo and behold, if I go over and select movie, and I go down to media types. And I go into my flicks. Well, I have a pile of them there. So just be aware of that. A lot of boxes do it like that. Some do, some don't. But just be aware of it. It doesn't mean if you can't see them that there's something wrong, basically. It just means you've selected the wrong option, okay? So just uh, to show you here now uh, a couple of things. So the first one I'm going to show you here is an XFID. Uh, it's an AVI. Okay, this would be by far and the most, uh, far and away the most common type of film that you might want to be playing back on this. Okay, so when you select it, it kind of launches in a thumbnail window there. And if you want to then, um, you know, expand it, all you hit to do is hit the red button, and that basically brings it to full screen. And you can fast forward through it and all sorts. So it's very handy like that. Okay, so I'm just going to exit out of that. The next one that I said. That you could play it was mp4 okay so i'm just going to select that and you can see it launching there okay now the next one that i'm going to select is an mkv which is another very common format um, that you might want to be watching films in and you can see it launching there. Now it'll also do VOBs as well. So that's it basically just to show you. And if you exit out of that then, you can just hit the exit button and basically um, you'll be able to go back to live TV then or whatever when you're finished watching whatever you're looking at, okay? So that's basically how to use the uh, media player functionality on the TV Star T1010 uh, DTT receiver.